wait, no doubt. This morning, we had to wait for some sunshine for many of you. I know at my house, I was high enough up, I didn't have to worry about any fog, but along the Mohawk, Hudson Valleys, and the Schoharie Valley, uh, there was a lot of thick fog. This is really a cool picture. It's what we call the visible satellite imagery. So it's like a snapshot, and you can clearly make out the fog right along and very close to the Hudson River. Look at this fog bank right here. This is the Schoharie Valley. This is the Mohawk Valley. So again, you can see where that fog set up. This time of year, typically it settles in the valley locations, and that's exactly what we had this morning. This is a, a really nice picture from Stratton, Vermont, from Mike Barnwell. Beautiful sunrise. And you can see in the valleys around the Green Mountains, see the valley fog here? So you're looking over the fog, and that's the sunrise this morning. It will likely happen again tonight, valley fog. 65 in Colony, Dwaynesburg 59, Ballston Spa 68, 64 at Hunter and Coble Skill, Ghent at 66, Pittsfield 63, look at North Adams, 69, it was really a, a delightful afternoon. 63 at Indian Lake, 68 in Queensbury, Manchester 64, and uh, 68 at Greenwich and Ballston Spa. Another winner today. Awesome. That high is going to be with us uh, for the next 24 hours. Now, the only fly in the ointment, the only bump in the road is this little storm system over Indiana that's going to work its way slowly east, arriving here on Friday. Uh, compared to 24 hours ago, a little bit cloudier and a little better chance of maybe a couple of showers uh, from the Mohawk Valley south on Friday. Uh, and then it should be out of here. By the weekend, another big wedge of dry air moves in and eventually uh, some warmer temperatures. Here's a look at the uh, future cast. There's that high nosing in, protecting us for one more day. So tomorrow, very similar to what we had today, maybe a degree or two uh, warmer. Then the clouds come in Thursday night. And again, here's that disturbance on Friday closer and a little bit wetter, so we have an increasing chance at getting some showers from Albany southward, and it will be a little bit cooler. High tomorrow, 73 in Albany, 74 Saratoga, Johnstown at 72. 72 in North Adams to 74 delightful degrees in Manchester. Now Friday with the clouds and a few showers, especially from about here, Clifton Park South, Upper 60s, Albany, Hudson, Pittsfield cooler at 65. To the north, better chance of being dry, close to 70 at Glens Falls and 68 at Johnstown. Our forecast tonight, mostly clear, cool, some dense valley fog, again, a low near 44. After the fog burns off, mostly sunny, 73 tomorrow. On Friday, mostly cloudy. Couple of showers, especially from Albany South, 67. Now Saturday, mostly cloudy, but at the afternoon we might start to, to clear out a little bit. But not bad, right? 73. Sunday looks great, 77, beautiful. Monday, another great day, 78. And look at this, Tuesday and Wednesday, partly sunny, low 80s, near record warmth on Tuesday. It's going to get a lot better. John? All right.